on the Green Growth Working Group, we are um, right now part uh, of, I think, how many? Six <laughs> working groups in, at DCD, focusing on questions of how private sector development can promote uh, the development of uh, or the change or transformation to green growth, greener growth, uh, from various angles. Um, we've got uh, currently a strong focus on the question how um, economic empowerment of women can actually uh, be linked to, to the questions of transforming green growth. Um, we are working on uh, questions of green growth diagnostics because we feel that it's a very, very important question if, when it comes to, for, uh, to the question for governments, how, what are the impacts of, uh, of our policies that we, that we uh, envision to, to, to implement. Uh, so what we're doing is trying to find out what models uh, are out there for exempting impact assessment, for example, what what are different organizations doing, what can they offer. So uh, what we're doing at GRZ, my project specifically looks at uh, questions of economic policy uh, with regard to sustainable economic development and uh, green growth is one large part of it where we look at various issues starting from um, uh, from phasing out of fossil fuels, uh, going through uh, ecotax the G G20 conference or summit in, in Seoul, 2010, and that's where uh, people started working on, or G20 started working on a development track which is called private in uh, investment and job creation. And out of this uh, process, they developed the idea to find innovative business solutions uh, that can be scaled up, that can be shown as best practice. And um, so they did a kind of challenge for uh, finding inclusive business models that are that fit to this to, to, to this description. Uh, we've just had a very interesting uh, session here at the Corporate Sustainability Forum in Rio de Janeiro on June 18th, uh, looking specifically in on how an enabling environment uh, for businesses actually um, uh, can support or. Uh, hamper the development of, of green and inclusive business. So what we're going to do next is in October, October 23rd, uh, 21st to 23rd, we will uh, arrange a, a session during the 15th International Business Forum, which takes place in Johannesburg. And uh, the session will specifically look at the South African uh, from the issues that, uh, that we identified through such dialogues as we had today, really see, okay, what are the policy measures that need to follow from this? Or what are certain steps that need to, that need to be done? Or where are certain links to, uh, the, between people uh, that we can connect to? And um, this is the idea that we have uh, when we think about something like a community of practice for supporting green and business, uh, green inclusive business solutions. And uh, I'd be happy to discuss with everyone who's interested to see how this kind of an idea of a community of practice uh, sp focusing very much on these questions can come.